How's it going, y'all? It's your boy here, ready to dive into the wild world of speedrunning and break some records. Now, I've achieved something that even a five-year-old Rebo would have called absolutely cat uh, on. Yep, nope. you're about to witness how I waltz my way right into a top 10 speedrun for Tekken 7's story mode. So buckle up, because this ride is about to be lit. But before we get into the nitty-gritty, you know the drill. As we know, every good speedrun starts with a ritual. So I suggest hitting that subscribe button and liking this video for top level high octane wow. performance in your next speed run. All right, so picture this. I'm scrolling through Tekken 8 videos, right? Practically serenading a framed picture of Harada-san like it's the holy grail. Just praying that January 26th arrives quicker. But then it hits me. What's a gamer like me supposed to do till Tekken 8 drops? And that's when speedrunning starts popping into my head. Could I possibly speedrun something in Tekken 7? After a bit of digging around on the internet, apparently you can speedrun Tekken 7. I found a sweet page on speed speedrun.com that's all about Tekken 7's story mode speedruns for all difficulties. Now, I was about as rusty as a P-Jack left out in the rain in Tekken 7 and fresh off Tekken 8's blinding light show of effects and flashbangs that happened during the CNT, after which, a little side note here, they mentioned that people have been complaining about them, so they will tone them down, which yes, is a good thing for it. everyone. Plus, I would never timed myself in a game. By the way, quick tip for newbies, live splits your buddy when it's coming to recording your times, which I found out is a requirement either way for speedrunning games. Got that out the way, installed Tekken 7 in like 12 hours, and I was finally ready to go. Honestly, I wasn't expecting much. I'm just doing my best to skip cutscenes faster than you can say. Careful trigger warning. Get over here. Just like the speedrunning gods do, you know? Couple of rounds and I'm like, huh? This ain't that bad. Until I got to playing as Lee and Alyssa. And my god, did I realize I'm not that good with these two but eventually i won and now i hate nina by the way i am a bit clueless on where cutscenes are placed in the game so i lost definitely some time there in my run kept my combos chill no flashy tricks believe it or not i had a time was it top 10 material <laughs> you bet did it get approved not that much as it turns out, I apparently read the rules, but not all of them. I did not include in the recording a clip of me showing the difficulty selection screen. So, the run was invalid. But I wasn't even mad. I thought, hold up, can I actually snag a top 10 spot without even breaking a sweat? So I dived back in. Sure, had a bunch of flops along the way. What? Bro, stop blocking me. Oh my, okay. <laughs> okay. What? Oh my god, okay. Get up! I'm gonna get you. Uh, I'm gonna nope. get... What? How dare you? Taunt. Oh. What? No. Stop! 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 Oh. I got this. No! Not again! Oh. oh, that was so close. I got you now. I got you now. No! Okay, please don't do it again. No, stop! Stop spamming, man! Stop! Why? I got you. No! This. Stop, Nina. Please, please. I got you. It's my game. It's my game. No! 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 Okay. Until that one round that really clicked. This time around, I made sure that I showed the difficulty selection screen. Robots, no problem. Nina, out of here, blondie. Lars first knife guy. I don't know, man. Lee and Alisa, still bad, but whatever. Determination and dedication brings the vacation. I should make that into a motivational poster. So, finally, I'm in a 1v1 with Kazuya. Fight's going down really smooth. I'm speedy, I'm slick, I'm old, but I'm ready to go. Almost dropped the ball a couple of times. And... Boom! 27.42! Let's freaking go! Did I make the cut this time? The wait felt like forever. Finally got that confirmation! Your boy Rubakun was crowned number 9! On the top 10 speedruns for Tekken 7's 
3 star story mode. Sun came out at 11.30 in the night, everyone was singing in the streets, planes were high in the sky with my name tag on them. It was a great feeling of accomplishment and it taught me a valuable lesson in determination and that little Rebo is finally throwing shade at his buddies. Yeah, you took the round, but are you a top 10 Tekken 7 speedrunner in the 3 star story mode? Now, until Tekken 8, we got a bit of time left, we're on to the ultimate challenge. Snatching that number one spot, baby. So, if we enjoyed riding shotgun on this insane journey of mine make sure you drop that like hit that subscribe button if you're vibing with the content and let me know in the comments if you're brave enough to take on the speedrun challenge with me let's get some of you guys with me on this list but only below me obviously all right it's been a wild ride with this one i'm ribokun you stay chill and i'll see you in the next one peace